Hi, I'm Lily Aldridge, and today we're going to show you how to train like an angel. And here is my trainer, Mary Helen Bauer. Hi, Lily. Hi. So excited to take you guys through a full body Ballet Beautiful workout. We're going to do an abbreviated version, but if you're following at home, you can do the full set, four sets of eight for almost everything. So we'll get started on our mat. You're going to extend the feet out, knees bent, pull in with that stomach, arms in a nice circle. We'll start with two sets of eight for our marching abs. Pull in with the stomach, lift and twist. So you're lowering back to the center and pulling in with those abs as you twist. And then we'll just sit up and take a nice stretch. So bend from side to side, up and over. You can really reach here. Other side. You're gonna come down on the side. You're gonna lift that leg and lower down, pulling in with the stomach, really extending long through that bottom leg. Hold it up at the top, and now lift here in a circle. Big range of motion, using the stomach. This is my favorite exercise to do. I think it's so effective and it makes your legs look so long and lean. So we do this almost every time we work out. And then you can reverse it. Everything in ballet comes from the inner thigh, so this is a real classic. Good, and just lift it up, hold here. So it's really important between each exercise to take a nice stretch so you're always releasing those muscles. The exercises themselves are tightening and toning, and the stretches are just gonna help keep everything really long. So our next exercise is for the outer thigh. We're gonna extend down on the mat, lift that leg up, hips are parallel. You're pulling in with the stomach, and we're working the outside part of the hip and thigh. Hold it up here, and then let's do a circle like we did with the inner thigh. You're gonna lift up and around. You're using the abs to stabilize. And then reverse it. And the more reps you wanted to do, the just more burn. Yeah, the deeper you feel it. Yeah. Now bring the knee in, so you're gonna drop the knees together and then extend it back out. This one's a lot more challenging, especially as you get fatigued. Yes. But it feels good. It feels great. My muscles feel, <laughs> you know, I can feel them. It feels amazing. And then just hold it up, extend long through that leg, tiny lift, and then we'll just lower down and take a nice stretch. So you wanna sit up and release the back of those hips and thighs. This is a good one for this. I love it, because you get the stretch right here. You just cross your leg over. For the next exercise, we're gonna come down on our mat and work on a one-legged bridge. You're gonna pull in with the stomach, lift up with the hips. You can lift up into your demi point. If you're a beginner, you could also try this with the feet flat, that's the modified version. So you're gonna pull in, lift up, extend that right leg, drop the foot, and lower the hips together. So you're gonna lift, extend, down, lower. Make sure you're not arching that back. Hold it up, extend that leg, and then a tiny lift here, lower and lift with the hips. So this is really burning through that butt and leg. I'm sure you're feeling that, Lily. It's burning. <laughs> <laughs> Drop down and we're gonna take a nice stretch. I'm gonna open up the muscles on both sides. Start with the hamstring, so back of the hip and thigh. Bend that knee in towards the chest and pull it back. That feels great for opening up the hip. For our first standing exercise, we're gonna begin with our lunge with swan arms. You're gonna open the toes a little bit, bend both knees down, use the abs, neck nice and long, stretch up, extend the elbows high, and lift. And so we'll just take the last one, bring the feet together, nice stretch. You can open up through the calves, through your sides. You're gonna cut into sixth position. Bend the knees, pull in with that stomach, neck nice and long. You're gonna bend the right arm over to the right, stretch up and lift to the left. That's great. And just reverse that position, keep the arms nice and long. You should feel that working through your side, through your obliques, your abs. And then you can take the leg off the floor for those lifts and that's gonna really work through the thigh as well. Keeping with that bend and stretch, really extend over. Good, and we'll take a nice stretch. 
As you're moving through the exercises today, you should take it at your own speed. Remember to drink plenty of water and stretch as you need to. And that is how you train like an angel.